Hello friends, welcome to my channel. This is Charan. In this video, I will show you how to enable and disable the drop down select option control with radio buttons using jQuery. So after reload the browser, if I select enable, see the select option element is enabled. If I select disable, see, see the select element is disabled. If I enable, we can use a select option. If it's disable, it's disable the select option. That's it. We have implemented jQuery functionality to enable and disable the select option control with radio buttons. If you are a first time visitor to my channel, please subscribe to get the latest updates. For this video tutorial, I'm using Notepad++. Notice in this Notepad++ contains a simple HTML code with some headed tags, H1, H2 and horizontal line. Uh, after the horizontal line, I am adding two radio button controls, one for the enable and the second control for the disable, the drop down list control. Input type is equals to radio value is equals to enable and the next property I am adding name is equals to between double quotes or the button. enable let's copy this one and the second radio button value I'm adding is disable disable is a label after that I'm giving break after break I'm adding the select option element which is a drop-down list control select I'm closing the select tag now inside the select tag option value is equals to selected disabled select colors is a default label for the select option element. Let's close the option tag. The next option tag I'm adding colors. The first color is a red option the second option is a blue and the third one is a white and the last color is a black that's it we have added the designing part in this html page which contains a uh, two radio buttons and one select option element now before adding the jquery functionality to enable and disable the drop down control with these radio buttons let's save this file we'll check the output how it looks the designing part on the browser and this is the output of that html code which contains headed access one heads to horizontal line and two radio button controls enable and disable below that i have a select option element which contains some values red blue white and black colors now my aim is i want to enable and disable with radio button controls using jquery functionality when we are implementing jquery functionality the first thing we require the latest jquery cdn link for that let's open a new tab search for jquery latest cdn google And from the search results, I'm selecting the first option, which is a hosted libraries. Select that one. In Google hosted libraries, notice at the corner there is a contents panel which contains a jQuery. Select that one. Here you can find the different jQuery CDN versions. I'm selecting the version is 3.3.1. Let's copy this link CDN and add in the header section. After that, come to the bottom, below the select option, I'm adding the script tag. I'm closing the script tag. This one is a small s. Inside the script, I'm adding the jQuery functionality to enable, disable the select option element. Dollar, between single quotes, I'm adding input name is equals to between double quotes 
I am adding the input radio name which is RD button. Notice here both radio button controls are name RD button only. After that on function within single quotes I am adding the change event function Here in on function I am writing the condition if a user selects the radio button enable I want to enable the select option element or if the user select the disable I want to disable the select option element dollar between single quotes here I am adding the element name which is a select name is equals to let's add a name to the select option name is equals to select color let's copy this one and paste here between double quotes dot attribute and this attribute takes two parameters the first one is a uh, the property I'm adding disabled comma this dot value is not equals to I'm adding the value of the radio button enable between double quotes that's it we have added the jQuery snippet to enable and disable the select option element let's save this file we'll check the final results on the browser I'm reloading the browser so after reload the browser if I select enable see the select option element is enabled if I select disable see see the select element is disabled if I enable we can use the select option if it's disabled it's disabled the select option that's it we have implemented jQuery functionality to enable and disable the select option control with radio buttons.